អង្គមរះប្រកាសបន្តខេត្តមណ្ឌលការនេះទីសមណាការហើយអឺមុនផ្ដល់ទៅពីតកាជុនទៅវិទ្យាវិទ្យាកុពេសុំជម្រាបល
Khmer 0027090 and French 0072967666. This report is writing something about um, two women. One is named Nai Chi, the wife of Seng. I see that the witness still hasn't. This one I know, uh, Mr. President, he has in front of him. This is E3 slash 4093. That's the document with your signature. And then I would like to take you, Mr. Witness, to Khmer page that ends with 9-0. And the document talks about two females, Nai Chi, the wife of Seng, and Pana. Are you seeing it? Mr. President, I have an extra copy. So like I said, um, Mr. Witness, I would like to draw your attention to what is written in relation to Nai Chi, um, and especially the box that I made for you. It says, and I read the English translation, this woman has contradictions with the revolution, leading to endless sorting out. But along with this, she constantly looks down on the leading card. As for her activities, she pretends to be crazy and endlessly steals everything. No matter how she is educated, she refuses to refashion herself. Um, my question, Mr. Witness, is to the sentence about the sentence, no matter how she is educated, she refuses to refashion herself. Would you be able to say anything about uh, the amount of times um, attempts were made to re-educate or refashion people in general? Would it happen that somebody was um, sent for re-education, finished the re-education, and then at one point in time came back? and was sent for re-education again and again and again. Would it happen that somebody would you be able to give an estimate as in general uh, up to how many times could somebody be sent for re-education? 
ពេលវេលាផែប្រមាណដែរដើម្បីធ្វើការអប់រំរៀនសូត្រមនុស្សម្នាក់នោះជាទូទៅគេប្រើពេលពីកន្លះខែ So did it happen that you know of that somebody was sent for re-education, came back and was sent for re-education again, but then for a longer period of time, and then came back again and was again sent for re-education? Okay, um, Mr. Witness, when somebody was sent to re-education office 105, also known as Krang Do you know if re-education was um, done there as well and if yes can you say something about how long the re-education could last for people who were sent to Krangtachan? ខ្ញុំអត់បានដឹងទេតែសភាពបែបនារីដែលមាននៅក្នុងឯកសារនេះបាទជាគេអប់រំនៅកន្លែងមេងនៅកន្លែងអង្គរកាកន្លែងមេ
ចាំមួយនឹងអ្វីដែលបានធ្វើនៅក្រាំងទៅចាំនោះអញ្ចឹងមែនទេ nhóm ắt đang sắc cam mập hiệp dạng chìa chìa nâu càng để chăn nữa thế do you know mr witness whether people who were sent to krang to chan were also interrogated about their alleged uh, activities អំពីសកម្មភាពដែលត្រូវបានគេចោទប្រកាន់តែលោកដឹងទេអំពីចំណុចនេះគេគេអាចសាកសួរចំឡើយនៅកន្លែងហ្នឹង Did you ever read interrogation reports or were you ever informed about the contents of interrogation, interrogations of people who were sent there? Uh, Mr. Witness, there is testimony before this chamber that would imply that people were sent to Krang Te Chan, the education center 105, without being interrogated and executed immediately. Do you know anything about this? เอ่อสัวจําหลายภลีมหรือตกอยู่สัวจําหลายอําอัดบ้านดังฉบับหลอเต้นั่นอืมแทงกิวมิสเตอร์มิสเตอร์วิทเนส um, um, I would like to ask you um, another question about um, words being used uh, within Democratic Kampuchea. And I would like to show you um, two reports, two Trump, Trump Court District reports. Um, the first one is E3 slash 2453. And that is uh, English ERN 00388586 and Khmer ERN 00270784. I have a copy with the relevant page with me, Mr. President, so maybe uh, if you allow the court officer to present this um, page from E32453 to the witness, and I would like to ask him a question. Mr. Witness, this seems to be a report from uh, Neng Nang, the district, and in the middle of that page, there's a sentence, and I would like to read that to you. 
it says in English my analysis is that they have plans to smash our revolution so it's in the orange it's in the orange uh, on the first page Mr. Witness it's on the orange uh, the orange color uh, so my question is about the sentence, my analysis that they have plans to smash our revolution. What does the word smash mean here? So it's another word than killing, is, is that what you're saying? Yes, that is I have one more example, um, Mr. Witness, that I would like to show you. Uh, Mr. President, this document is not on the interface, um, so I'll, I'll, I'll be slowly in putting it before the witness. It's E3 slash uh, 2053. The English ERN is 0027657 and uh, Khmer ERN is 000 And I would like to ask your permission, Mr. President, to also present this document to uh, the witness. I also have it, the paragraph colored for easy reference. Just for the record, to move things along, we have no objection. Thank you, Mr. Brosser. For the transcript, Nous en avons une, en tout cas une réserve. Est-ce que le confrère peut nous présenter le document, que nous puissions avoir la capacité de le lire avant qu'il puisse le présenter aux témoins Je crois que c'était les règles que nous avions tous convenues. Est-ce qu'on peut du coup avoir la possibilité de prendre connaissance du document avant que le confrère pose une question et distribue le document aux témoins Um, I, I just said very, very slowly uh, the E3 uh, number, so I would imagine I even see prosecution help being helpful. So I, I think the um, civil party lawyer should be able to get this document on his screen. Je demande une clarification au président sur ce point.
bà là ní miền cả mình kiểm toa đời dạ vị nhá ai hôm nay ai mi tv nó mốc đồng nàng đang mình đang đặt vào vị ní miền cả chọn ngày bằng hai hay ông phía ký ban bằng hai hơi nơi ai lấy ai cả xá ý bấy lư mập hay sạ mập hay hà sập bay hay ta lục trai mi tv hàng mi tv nó một trong nàng đầm nó làm lý trai cà phê bự lia bị nứt ai cả xa nâng đại đại tế hay bà trai cà phê màn giải phê bự màn làm bài ai chờ ông nhầm ra sầm rách hay nâng ở miền cà sô đỉnh đầu chụp bộ bẹp bòn nâng ai cả xa đi đầu mi tv nôn chi chụp bộ xả sấy merci merci monsieur le président nous avons bien évidemment entre temps Uploader le document sur notre écran. Je crois qu'il y a simplement un, un problème. Notre confrère ne comprend pas le principe du contradictoire. Le principe du contradictoire, c'est que les parties soient notifiées à l'avance de l'utilisation des documents qui sont faits en audience. Donc, il suffit de quelques minutes pour que nous soyons notifiés, que nous puissions le télécharger et qu'à ce moment-là, le document soit présenté aux témoins. Nous ne demandons que ça. Il s'agissait de quelques minutes que nous avons pu utiliser lorsque vous étiez en train de délibérer, mais il me semble important que la procédure soit encore une fois respectée par tous. bà học quân hay dừng chỉ diêm nông ca mù là hết ấy ban chỉ ông nhầm ra về đại lục bây giờ bây giờ cổ pe đại cả xá đại bằng hai thạch luôn mình bàn tại nơi nông yên thực phế liêm phần bề đại cả xá miền tây tầm phố ông nhầm ra giờ bảy hà này bị phía xa tầm nơi ông chỉ đại xá ông nhầm ra miền bầm nong ở phía ký ăn nó vọt đại ban mừng mặt nơi sạch đầy này non là bọn ông nhầm ra ông nhầm ra ban thứ trong cầu ấy bắt đầu bị ban bị nứt lơ sau đây làm rải lơ muôn đã bắt luôn cả bị nằm bị bòn đập mồi đập bìa nó ní cứ cố bầm nón làm bài đầm rơi ở cụ phê ký anh vật ở ban tiền tuất mừng mắt nơ sẽ cái đây này nó mới được bắt ông nhầm ra bẹp bòn nâng cả đại cả xa ní nông cả này mình bàn đã trai bằng hai nhà bị hẹp hoa từng lái đại khuôn mình bàn đã hơi sống cả anh nhạt bị ông nhầm ra chỉ muôn hơi rùm tiếng là phía kì xây chết nâng biên sức và đo mà tệ dụ bó môn nâng ông dùm rẻ xong rảnh Còn tế bánh hà âm bánh mạnh ní vì phái trọng thá phía kì mà kháng tiết miễn dạ hạ bệ nhá mình dùm tòa thì hay bánh hà kháng mì tử vi nó mốc nàng đang vào ní dùm nâu có mình dùm tòa này còn tế lực hạt phát và chết rùm lực hồi bán chấp bật lô ông bí ca nè nôm ăn vót bó ông dùm rẻ bẹp bó nâng bánh hà ní phần nọ và xong rồi lực cục bế lực cái đó ý cứ xong bằng tay nó mới ăn vật tạm ca này nó bỏ ông ở trên đường dùm ra sự khâm tham mình mình chỉ ca nghi ấy thuần ở bê chi nông ca ăn vật cầm rật bật bật đi và mình hẹt phó nó ở dùm ra bàn này nó phía kì rùi hời mà lấy ông dùm ra ăn nhạt và to xùm nùa đi hay xong rồi lực thà với chơi cục bế thà phía kì ní cứ miền trái cả là mong tiết hay nâng ấy bởi ai to đó ấy cứ miền trái mùi vẹn tí cứ trầm bê chạp đám là hốt đo bê xong rạ bọn nọ ở chỗ bạc lọ của mình những miền còn cho lắm tham mùi bức xài mình mềm tí cứ mùi vẹn thầm bê chạp đám là hốt đo bê xong rạ nợ bức xài bọn nọ Thank you, Mr. <coughs> Thank you, Mr. President. Just to clarify, this is a typical document <coughs> that came up uh, at the second day of uh, questioning by the prosecution. So um, sometimes things come up, and that's why uh, I would like to use this document. It's, it's impossible to always know in advance exactly uh, what we are trying to ask. So the idea is to follow procedures. We have acknowledged that this might happen, yes, and we have established have a procedure. Yes, yes. So, Mr. Witness, I would like to show you, and with the permission of the President, um, I will bring that to you, or have that brought to you, um, E3-2053. <coughs> I would like to ask you to have a look at the sentence that I colored in orange. 
ចាំពីមួយ Uh, Mr. Witness, this is a report currently from Trump Pang Tom South Cooperative. And I would like you to have a look at um, English ERN 0027 And you have in front of you the Khmer ERN, which I don't have now. Um, in the middle, or in, in the third paragraph of this report, it says as follows. Their, their plans are as follows. And the plans, the, the, the document is talking about uh, four people who are having plans. It says, number one, their five-year plan is to ensure uh, the smashing of the cooperatives. If they cannot destroy them in five years, then seven years. And if they still cannot smash them, they have further plans to do whatever is necessary to wear down the cooperatives and to absolutely oppose communal dining. Uh, my question is a very simple and short one. Um, the word smash, contact, is being used here as well. Um, can you tell us if, if you know what the word smash means here. Thank you, Mr. Witness. My final subject is the following. Uh, that's your position in relation to uh, teaching. Uh, you, as I understand, had a position uh, in respect of education both before DK and maybe also during DK. Can you tell the Chamber what was the general purpose of education within DK? What were the aims of the CPK in relation to education of the people? Are you able to tell us something in general about these objectives? ก็โลกเมทาวีสัวខ្ញុំឲ្យបានច្បាស់លាស់បន្តិចព្រោះថាការអប់រំ um, more specific my question is what were what was the purpose what were the objectives during the DK regime in respect of education of children, uh, small children, older children, students. What did the DK authorities envisage? What did they try to achieve in terms of education? ກົມມາບັງຮຽນຄເມງຄເມງທີ່ຫນຶ່ງຄືຖ້າບັງຮຽນອາສໍ
รียบซาเมืนประกันกับเกียรยาเชียเนี่ยเพลิดเพลินเชียเนี่ยปีเลียวาสายยมสมออ so was it the objective of um, the DK regime to organize um, primary education to small children secondary education to older children and also to create uh, universities in other words was one of the purposes, as you remember, of the DK to educate people, educate students, um, mathematics, languages, etc. เมียนกาบังเรียนเมียนกาวิธีบังเรียนดอลโกมาเมียนปีดอซอเรียนเลขเรียนอซอใต้เพียซามันเมียนเดนเวลเวตึบนึงจับดามทำไมทำไมเลขอซอเมียนเมียนภูมิบัตเชียเมียนภูมิบัตเชียคลาดได้ขณะบัวใบชนำหรือบัวชนำเต้าเมียนภูมิบัตเชียคลาดได้เฮ้ยเมียนเชียเสียวเผาเสียวเผาปังเรียนอ่ะซอเสียวเผาน่ะกันนิดบัตเชียกับเมียนได้กันนิดบัตเชียนั่งขนมเล็กยังไงมาสมองตาเพียซามันตอนเมียนเต้ลงเมตวีเรียนภาษาบอติมันตอนนี้ตีตายปีดายปีดายไปเจจนรถกระดอกปรุงด้านก็เมียนเรียนเรียนภาษาภาษาอังเล่ภาษาไทยนั่งในกรรมเจียเจียทับตายเมียนกูนโยบายมึงเรียนจังลองมีนจมหัวรู้ตัวเดียวไว้ในอัมพีจมหัวของการมองเรียนของน้องสมัยขมายกระหอมเทศตามมีนกรุบเรียนกรุบกรอนเทศหรือก็เรียนโลกอภิเชียมสไปรกรุบเรียนดับใบอ้อยบังเรียนบานตาโลกอาจจะรับมาติดที่อัมพีโคมนองบังเรียนเนี่ย phê tràn kêu bằng riêng đâu hàng trăm cọ phê tràn chia chia nề ri thế chia nề ri cầm lăng nề ri ấy ca bản đọc bản đá ấy cứ miền ca bản đọc bản đá làm pi bắt chế cái tê làm pi này chất bật chia ấy khai đai chất bật chia làm pi bắt chế cái tê khăn ông ca bằng riêng giang mấy giang mấy cứ tham miền ca bản đọc bản đá miền ca ấm rúm đào kêu kêu ขนมแต่มะไข่มะดองมะไข่มะดองหรือมาไตรเมียมะดองมาสมเชียง When you were teacher in the DK period was that a reason to be fearful? Were teachers being threatened in the DK period? Or were they trying to make you feel safe? Or were they trying to make you feel safe? Or were they trying to make you feel safe? ai tập tua kêu mà rồi làm nẹt nắng khi nhom mình bàn mình bàn lọp tập tua chân tê cặp con tai kêu bằng riêng đâu sọc tam cọ ní mình miền nẹt nà miền cà phê khai ấy âm pi để vô bài rồi bọc cầm chìm chìm tập tài tê kê ruột đâu tam sạ có thầm đá kê thứ ca nghĩa tam sạ có thầm đá
បាទនេះពិតជាចម្លាយដែលលោកបានឆ្លើយជូននាក់សិបអង្កេតមែនទេបាទត្រឹមត្រូវហើយពេលឆ្នាំ <coughs> ហើយប្រគល់ទួលនាទីនេះឲ្យខ្ញុំទទួលខាងផ្នែកអប់រំទទួលខុសត្រូវផ្នែកអប់រំមាថាភាសាលើកហៅអប់រំយុវជននឹ
สมัยใบชนะเมียนนเพียบเมียนเมียนเสียวเพิ่มเมียนไอบานนายฉบับหลอดหายมอชนะเนี่ยกาวกรามกาวบมุ้ยนี่ก็เมียนเสียวเพิ่มบานฉบับหลอดได้สลาเรียนเมียนเพียบลอเนี่ยฉนะกาวกรามกาวบมุ้ยเมียนเพียบลอชราเมียนเตี้ยสบายเมียนตกเมียนไอบานลอทำเท่าไอ้สมัยใบชนะเรียนกรามดามเชอเรียนไอจังเต้าตามได้ได้เมียนตามลาตะเพียบไอเมียนกระไรคล้าเมียนเตี้ยเมียนสบายเมียนสลาเมียนตกเมียนไอจังเมียนเมนตายบ่อยเปรียบเทียบเต้าสมัยกาวพรามกาวบมุ้ยดอยไล่เต้ดอยไล่ยำเนาสมโลเต้ตายตูเตียงเต้ยำอัดดังเต้กาวพรำกาวประมวยนอสมโลดเวลาอ้อเชียงสมัยใบชนะการศึกษาอมรมไอขยมตะตัวคางภายในอบรมอยู่จนนั่งแกลาสกนั่งคือขนมตะลักไทยบนอ้อขยมเจอครูครูตังอ้อบ่อประชุมดอกพิศวัตอมปีการเงียศึกษาอมรมนอสมัยชนะกาวพรำกาวประมวยนี่เองสมสมอลูกเมตวีมายล่าสคำถามเกี่ยวกับสถานการณ์ของการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าผลกระทบในการศึกษาในดีเคไม่สามารถบอกได้ว่าตาสังเกตุเรื่องพักพอลตลอดวิสัยอบรมพักพอลตลอดกิจศึกษาจิตดามละดูมันไหนสังเกตุปีจัดสับลูกสัวจัดพรำจัดจัดสับดอกจัดพรำแมนเด As you, as you know, as we all know, there was a long civil war up until 1975. The question is whether you can say something about the effects of the war on the education system. The government is trying to make a point. สองเกรียมปีจัดสัปดาห์จัดสัปปรามระยะเปรตปรามชนะเชียงโดยชนะปะปอลทอมเทนนาดอลวิสัยศึกษาอบรมสลาเรียนกติกตีภูมิฐานวอดลูกซองไอเมย์เมย์เปรนุดดอลอ่อนจังเต้าเต้ากาบังเรียนเมย์กูเนากรามดำเชื่อคลาไฮหนึ่งซองสังเตียพระสบายพระสลักนอตได้ตามหลักเพียบเธอตกเปียไซปีเชอไอ้ว่าตามหลักเพียบกลายแต่เธอบ้านโดยฉะนั้นสังเกตุปรามชนะนี่คือปากปอลอย่างทมเทิงดอลปฏิกรรมปีเชยนั่งขยมในเย็ดดอยไล่เนื้อไข่ตะกายแต่ตูเตียงปฏิขยมมันบานดังเตะMy my last question, Mr. My last question, Mr. Witness, was it the purpose of DK to rebuild the education as quickly as possible and uh, to repair the destruction the war had caused? Is that what the purpose was in terms of education uh, in DK? ปตอปีจอบสังเกียมปรามชนามเต้การมีเจียบเจียบตะไคร่เมียนกูลบ่มบ่มน้องบิสัยคังศักษาอบรมนี่คือเมียนกูลบ่มน้องทอมเทนนะขัดคำเรียบจำสลาเรียนทำไมทำไมขัดคำในประมาประโมสเอาโจเรียนลางวิ่งไอในหนึ่งเมียนครูขัดคำอบรมครูบังเรียนครูเอาเจ้าคัง Kerukasal pengrian sah, 
nâng nè ní chia cô lùm nón rồi bỏ cam chia chia thực tay tiền luôn hai nâng miên cô lùm nón thông thiên tràn tiết không bị say ập rùm này nâng chầm sông chầm riệp và nâng lục mi thì bị Thank you very much, Mr. Witness. Thank you, Mr. President. Uh, I'm going to talk about the question of 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 the question bây giờ đồng vốn là bổn phận hay bằng mảnh cái mỹ tv cà phê cái đây là nôn chi ban trả lời bạn trẻ rồi hay là bạn nhà này là những ai mệt tạm ai cả sa i bây rồi đọc bằng bốn làm bờ ta miền bắc tây yêu bò đá ok dầm phòn mà miền tây khi dầm phòn bạn miền tây nôn chia có bàn chơi bạn chơi chầm hồ rồi chơi bạc lo hơi nè thà còn mình chầm to to ba tí hay còn xong mọi thứ ta đặt cái cam thạ thấy nút bàn chập tiệt phòng Monsieur le Président, sur le fond et la question directement posée, la déposition écrite de cette personne a déjà été beaucoup évoquée, utilisée lors de cette audience et nous ne nous opposons donc pas à la comparution de cette personne car nous sommes très attachés à la règle 84 du règlement le respect du principe du contradictoire. Si vous décidez effectivement de faire venir ce témoin à la barre, il conviendra toutefois que vous nous donniez du temps pour lire les 16 classeurs de déposition tiré des dossiers 3 et 4 qui ont été transmis par les procureurs et qui constituent une énorme masse de documents, non seulement à lire, mais à analyser. Il y a beaucoup probablement d'autres témoins qui évoquent les mêmes questions que celles qui sont traité par le témoin dont nous parlons à l'instant, et afin de pouvoir contre-interroger correctement cette personne, il convient bien évidemment que la défense puisse prendre connaissance non seulement de la déposition du témoin dont nous parlons, mais également de toutes les autres dépositions qui ont été transmises pour l'instant par le procureur et qui pourraient traiter des mêmes thèmes. Sur ces questions toujours, je tiens à dire que jeudi dernier, dans l'après-midi, lorsque vous avez tenu une audience de mise en état sur la question des 16 clusters qui ont été transmis par les procureurs et eh bien, nous avons demandé six semaines de délai sans audience pour pouvoir procéder à l'analyse, à la lecture et au travail à partir de ces dépositions. Puis, le lendemain, euh, votre juriste hors classe, M. Ken Roberts, euh, a transmis au parti un mail euh, au sujet duquel euh, je souhaite demander maintenant une clarification. Euh, dans ce mail, il est indiqué que votre chambre 
ne va pas reporter la comparution du témoin qui est devant nous parce que la demande en a été formulée trop tardivement, que cette personne est âgée et qu'elle habite loin de Phnom Penh. Et puis, il est également dit que le témoin suivant, TCW 948, sera entendu dans la foulée, mais il n'est pas expliqué dans ce mail pourquoi ce témoin est maintenu. Je ne sais pas si nous devons comprendre de cette absence d'explication que c'est la totalité de la demande, des demandes des partis qui avaient été formulées à l'audience de mise en état de la veille qui ont été rejetées, ou si votre chambre s'est uniquement emparée d'une partie du problème pour dire que le témoin qui est devant nous comparaîtrait quand même, que le témoin suivant également, même si on ne nous explique pas pourquoi, mais j'ignore quelle est très exactement la position de votre chambre sur les demandes qui avaient été formulées lors de la mise en état. Je l'ignore d'autant plus que je n'ai pas manqué, comme probablement tout le monde ici, de noter que dans votre communication du lendemain, Monsieur le Président, qui portait sur les dates des vacances judiciaires, vous indiquiez au parti que celle-ci pouvait profiter des périodes pendant lesquelles la, la Chambre ne siégeait pas pour travailler les nouveaux éléments qui lui seraient éventuellement communiqués. Je ne sais pas de quoi vous vouliez parler lorsque vous évoquiez ces nouveaux éléments qui seraient éventuellement communiqués, mais il m'a semblé, en lisant ce, ce texte, que cela pouvait éventuellement concerner les 16 classeurs pour lesquels, je le redis ici, nous réclamons un délai de six semaines afin de procéder non seulement à la lecture, mais à leur analyse. Pour terminer, je tiens à rappeler que la crainte de la défense de M. Kiosampan dans la situation qui est la nôtre aujourd'hui, c'est que se réitère la pratique qui a été adoptée dans le premier procès, à savoir que votre chambre a décidé, alors que nous étions en train de rédiger notre mémoire finale, de nous annoncer qu'elle considérait comme étant versée au débat à peu près, grosso modo, 1500 déclarations écrites en lieu et place de témoignages et que eh bien, cette décision fait bien évidemment partie des moyens d'appel que nous avons soulevés contre votre premier jugement. J'entends bien que pour l'instant, vous avez évoqué le fait que les enquêtes des dossiers 3 et 4 étant toujours en cours, vous n'étiez pas en mesure de maîtriser une sorte de flux de communication future qui pourrait intervenir et voir ainsi transvaser des dépositions écrites des dossiers 3 et 4 vers votre procès, mais il me paraît qu'une telle position n'est pas raisonnable. Vous ne pouvez pas, à mon sens, dans le cadre d'un procès équitable, poser que ce robinet d'alimentation de dépositions écrites et de nouveaux éléments sera perpétuellement ouvert. Vous devez décider d'une règle, qu'elle soit chronologique, en fixant une date, ou d'une règle កំណត់ឲ្យលោកនយាយនៅក្នុងមលងពេលប្រជុំធាមអំក្លងមកលោកមិនបានចូលរួមប្រជុំពិភាក្សាទីថ្ងៃនេះអង្គចម្រះបាន
ដោយបំពូនស្លាស់បំពលនៅក្នុងការស្ដាប់សក្តិ TCW ពុំមែនជាកម្មវត្ថុនៃការសុំលើកសក្តិសម្ដាប់សក្តិធ្វើសក្តិមណាការរបស់មេត្តាវីនួនជាទេមេត្តាវីនួនជាលើកឡើង
Oui, mais il y a des transcrits que je lis, M. le Président. Voilà, et je les ai lus en l'occurrence. Merci, Monsieur le Président. Nous n'avons pas d'objection à la comparution du témoin qui est proposé par les coprocureurs. បាទអរគុណសម្ណាការថ្ងៃនេះដល់ពេលជប់តម្រាក់ហើយអង្គយំរះប្រកាសប្អាក់កិច្ចដំណើរការសម្ណាការសម្រាប់ថ្ងៃ